So, you've done well for yourself. What? What, what are you doing here? Is that how you greet your mother, Trevor? Are those lips fake as well, or just the tits? How's your mom, Trevor? I miss her. So, like, I gotta ask. Has anything changed, or are you dudes still the same? Has Michael changed? Let me think. Hmm. Well, he changed his name and came back from the dead. That's kind of a big change. Yeah, Trevor ain't changed at all. He's always had anger issues. Anger issues? How you doing? Me? <laughs> Anger issues. And other issues. Oh! Well, what? Other issues? Mother issues. You did not just say that. He did not just say that. I said it. How is your mom? That is none of your business. She's such a sweet, a delicate flower. I don't want I don't want her to see me like this. Mother issues! I will cut a hole in your throat and pull your tongue out if it looks like it's starting to form the letter M. <laughs> and anger issues. Hey there. Okay, uh, I, I see. It's good to hang out, kid. Listen, tell me about yourself. Give me the lowdown. Give me the scoop pie. Give me the truth. For real? I guess it was kind of tough, dog. You know, I, I grew up in Los Santos. Here? Yeah. Tough? Listen, I grew up in five states, two countries, 14 different homes, eight fathers, three care homes, two correctional facilities, one beautiful, damaged flower of a mother. I've served time, my country, your country, and myself. I've committed every mortal sin. I've loved, hated, and searched for meaning. And do you find me saying things were tough, do you? Listen, kid, if you take one thing away from me, it is that self-mythologizing and self-pity are for the weak. You got me? Yeah, I, I got you. Sure. Good. Look at that punk-ass bitch. Whatever. Well, shit, it says something about the people in my life where you two seem almost sane to me. Hey, man, don't bag on your auntie so much. You need an older female influence in your life. Yeah, sure, I agree. Ever since my mom chose to pipe over her baby, man, I've been lacking a feminine role model. Your mom left? Wasn't left for long before they found her dead. Crazy dude. I bet you were born fully formed with, like, sharp teeth and a pointy little heart on. I was a child. I had a mother. She left me too. <laughs> Shit, can you blame her? She came back. She left again. She came back. She left again. Wow. She must really like hurting you. Lamar, man, cut this shit out. It's tough, man. Tough. Don't say anything about my mom. All right, all right, homie. Chill, just chill out. Give me a sip of that. What? Come on, my throat's dry as a motherfucker. Why? Is your mother dry when you're... <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck is that, huh? Nothing. Well, it didn't sound like nothing, all right? It didn't seem like nothing. I don't think... That it was nothing. I didn't mean nothing by it, old man. Old man? Old man! Fuck you, creepy old motherfucker. That's right. I said it. Creepy. Old! Motherfucker! No! Jesus. Huh? No, come on. Get what? Up. What? What? Sorry. Now, where sorry. were we on, exactly, huh? Get up. Ah. Sorry, man. We're Help. sorry. Help! There's a guy with a gun! <laughs> So, you've done well for yourself. What? what? What are you doing here? Is that how you greet your mother, Trevor? I, 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 I didn't know they let you out. So you never wrote to me? You never visited? What? Well, I, I bet you never found a girl. Tell me, Trevor. Are you gay? No. Is that what this is all about? No. I wouldn't care. In fact, I've always wanted a gay son. A son who wouldn't forget about his mother. But Ma! But Ma, but Ma, but Ma, nothing. Not a peep. I 
carried you in here. I fed you. I weaned you. Now look at you. You always were an ungrateful, wretched, sniveling sack of shit of a boy. You know it, and I know it. There was always something wrong with you. Ashamed of yourself. Ashamed of me. Of your own mother. I've been here for hours. And have you gotten me a drink? Or a cigarette? Or massage my feet? I'm an old woman. And you, in the prime of life, have you nothing inside? I'm so sorry. I am... <laughs> There, there, it's okay, son. <laughs> oh, that's it now! Here I am, old and tired and alone. I'm so sorry for everything. Exactly, for everything. I'm an old woman, Trevor. I don't got no insurance. Oh, I got money! I don't want your goddamn money! Is that what you think I am? A prostitute? Still? You're sick. What should I do? I'm in a lot of pain. I need you to get me some more Deludamol. I can do that. A lot of them. A truckload, literally. And not those weedy little ones. The thousand milligram ones. And if you find me a gentleman, well, we both know you need a father figure. Ah! <sighs> 